Watch you guys, it's great to be back after my holiday break and I'll be making more videos again uh, more regularly now I'm back off my holidays and as you can see we have a ransomware one here for you and uh, this one is Russian and it's a master boot record lock or locker and it basically locks you out of your computer and what it's asking for is the demand of 600 ruples and this says attention your PC has been blocked for viewing and distribution of pornography Now this is obviously fake so don't fall for that type of thing and I will put a translation of this on the screen right now so you can see the full message in English if you wish or if you can read Russian obviously you can read that message on there already so what we're going to do is we use two methods to remove this because you can't boot into safe mode or safe mode with networking or safe mode with command prompt it locks you completely out does this by changing the master boot record it's a master boot record locker and uh, we're going to be fixing it with uh, Windows recovery uh, CD or Windows CD now if you don't have a Windows CD I'll also show you a way to use uh, Hiram's boot CD which is a free download and you can use that to fix the master boot record as well so you've got the best of both worlds there so let's have a look at the actual message here there is a phone number or a number at the top there you can see now this will change from time to time with different ransoms so this code might not work if the number is different in this location here so the code to use for this one is on the screen now and it will free you from this ransom and you should be good to go from there now if it doesn't work you can always use this method that I'm going to show you now so first off we'll try the Hiram's boot CD method so I'm going to reboot into Hiram's boot CD and fix this okay so I've got my Hiram's boot CD in the uh, DVD drawer there you need to make sure you change the uh, boot order inside your BIOS to boot to uh, CD or USB thumb drive whatever you're using I'm going to come down to DOS programs here. Now I'm using uh, Hiram's 15.0. Uh, um, you can use whatever version you like. And uh, the next thing we need to do here is come down to number 9, which says next, down the bottom. And once we've done that, we want to come up to master boot record tools. And uh, I'm going to be using the MBR work 1.08. That's the one I'm going to be using for this. I'm going to go like this. just let that load up now you'll get this screen come up and what we want to do here is uh, click on number five number five install standard MBR code okay so we're going to tap number five here and push enter now you're going to get two choices down here and it's going to say one for standard and one for Windows 7 now if you have got Windows XP then you can use the number one for standard and that will fix your Windows XP um, code and you've also got Windows 7 which is this is Windows 7 32 bit we can use number 2 so I'm going to push number 2 and push enter and it will ask are you sure you want to continue and say yes why for yes and then we want to push E for exit and I'm going to take the CD out and reboot the system So as you can see now, we have now fixed our master boot record. Let this boot up. And there you have, we're back at the desktop. One problem quickly resolved. OK, so let's quickly show the commands that you're going to need if you've got your Windows CD and I'll quickly boot to my Windows CD and show you what you need to do to follow the same process to fix this issue. So let's reboot the system into our Windows CD. So this is the recommended method I would use if I, if you've got a Windows CD I would use the Windows CD over the Hiram's Boot CD method. I'm going to go next here and then we want to repair our computer. I'm 
going to go next here. What we want to do is open up a command prompt. I want to change this to D or whatever drive is for your Windows. Now we can do that by doing D and colon and then I can check DIR to make sure that we're in the right directory. And I can see there is a Windows directory here so I know I'm in the right place to do my command to fix my master boot record. So what I want to do next is type boot rec forward slash fix boot and then fix MBR. Fix MBR is probably the best way to go first. And then what you want to do here is push enter once you've done that. So we've got to fix boot and fix MBR and then push exit and reboot the system. So make sure you move, remove the CD and then boot the system back up and you should be good to go from there. And there we have the back to the desktop and the problem's been resolved. Now obviously I'd still run some scans here just to make sure there's nothing on the system. Um, Malwarebytes, Hitman Pro, um, Super Anti Spyware, stuff like that and do an online scan just to make sure the system's fully cleaned, clear out temporary internet files and also empty your restore points and um, make a new restore point once you're fully cleaned. And that's pretty much it for this video. So I hope you enjoy these videos. My name is Brian from brightech.co.uk. If you enjoy these videos, please remember guys, hit that subscribe button and show your support. Also rate and favorite all my videos if you enjoy them. And I'll be making more videos again in the future. So thanks again for watching guys. And thanks again for sticking around. Bye for now.